What's up, friends? It's Sergio with BustingPacks.com and SportsCardAlbum.com here with a box of 2013 Topps Museum Collection football. Um, I've got to admit, I was a moron when I first saw that this thing was coming out. I was like, ah, you know what? I love Topps Valor. I thought it was beautiful designs. All that stuff was cool. But collectors didn't appreciate it. it ended up losing value really fast. The box was worth a fraction of what they were. Dude. I had no idea from the preview picks the Tops had released just how sick this product was going to be. Uh, and now after looking at the Beckett and Blowout forums um, and eBay, looking at some of the hits, what makes it really popular is it's got a huge veteran checklist. So you look at these equipment tags, autographs, Andrew Luck, RG3, Beast Mode. There's a Beast Mode there. Here's another sick Marshawn Lynch 101 patch autograph, Jamal Charles 101. Look at that, Patriots. This is an actual guy on blowout cards. Pulled that out of 25. Sick multi-patch. Deshaun Jackson. Peyton Manning, you know, autographs. The framed autographs are gorgeous. Uh, someone just pulled a Peyton Manning one of one. And, uh, you know, you look at these framed variations, which are gorgeous. I really hope, uh, I think they're the case hit. Uh, I'd love to pull one. The Kurt Warner is going for $125 plus dollars. You don't see Kurt Warner autographs going, you know, from Exquisite going for $100 these days. So, look, you got gold autographs numbered out of five. There's a Cordero Patterson silver ink uh, framed collection. Uh, Eddie Lacy, just patches. Tyler Reford, I mean, that's a 101, but uh, some DeAndre Hopkins. That's an Eddie Lacy framed 101. So a lot of the big hits are already pulled, but just a really, really cool product. Um, had some more over here just to show off. Uh, Got uh, Matt Barkley. That's just a standard patch autograph. Beautiful design. There's a Monty Ball one of one that looks very similar to last year's Tops Five Star, which is one of my favorite designs ever. That's a patch auto variation of uh, the Eddie Lacy. So you can see you've got a couple different variations. There's the dual one uh, over here is just the quad, you know, and then you've got the triple jersey autograph stuff like that. So anyway, I'm very excited to bust this. I'll leave all those in the background. Uh, just so that you can gawk at them while we bust this thing. Uh, let me straighten out the camera. And let's do it. One autograph or relic card per mini box. And we get four mini boxes in this box. Five cards in each one. I actually like just the straight up uh, base cards. But it's a very, very pretty product. And uh, it's it's doing phenomenally well. So rather than being like Topps Valor, which actually lost value, uh, I'm thinking Museum Collection might go the way of 2013 or 2010 Topps Supreme, which actually ended up uh, significantly increasing in value after release. I'll leave that open. And what I'll do to speed up some time is cut all these open at the same time. So here we go, 2013 Topps Museum Collection Football. Turkey Red just came out today on their website. I had a problem ordering. I was trying to order it by three boxes and uh, kicked me, it kicked me out and I pressed refresh again and I was thinking maybe it's gonna charge me twice. Maybe it's gonna bill me and double my order. Uh, no, it turns out it ended up just kicking me out. I didn't get anything. So uh, I'm not sure I had to go to work. I was doing stuff so I don't even know if I'm gonna get any of that. Okay, so that's the setup. You got two base on the bottom, two base on the top. Let's see if we can focus in on that. It's a lot to focus on, that background. There we go. So let's see. Here's Steve Largent. I was just talking about Steve Largent the other day. He was on the ESPN uh, NFL channel, actually, NFL channel Greatest Hands. He was, like, number three. I love Steve Largent. Loved watching him uh, growing up. Christian Michael, popular running back right now on the forums uh, with the Super Bowl champion Seahawks. Joseph Randall out of Oklahoma State. Uh, oh, I accidentally buzz killed myself. Uh, Sidney Rice, who did not play in the Super Bowl. <whistles> Still Super Bowl champ. Look at the sickness of that. Patch autograph, 13 out of 50. And if you look at this patch, it's actually, you can see that, the multicolor. So it's, you've got the green stitching, but then you've actually got the, the uh, well-known... Uh, Seahawks multicolored touch in there. Just a beautiful card. Really, really tops. This is a pretty football product. That's a very, very nice looking card. 
the gold trim uh, is nice a little drop shadow inside of here actually makes it look I thought it was three-dimensional for a second really really pretty card okay moving right along we're already five minutes into this and I'm one pack in but those of you that are subscribed to my YouTube channel know that I'm not exactly a uh, person that shuts up I don't know Marshawn Lynch Beast mode in the house. Beautiful action photography on that base card. Johnny Elway gold. Ooh, that's pretty. Johnny Elway gold. Let's see what that's number two. Number two out of 99. Love that. Scrambling. My man. Zach Ertz. Beast mode. And again, I've got to get better. This is Tom Brady. Base. Jonathan Franklin, running back for the Packers, signature card, numbered out of 130. That is on card. So my next couple are probably going to be uh, patch cards. Hopefully I get another autograph. I'd love to get another patch. Oh, this is a fattest. This is a huge patch. What in the world? Oh, my gosh. They've got books in this. I did not know that they have books. Dual Jumbo Relic Book Card. Topps Museum Collection Football Dual Jumbo Relic Book Card. Holy crap. That's pretty exciting. I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to save that. Oh my gosh, I never pull booklet cards. Like unless I'm buying Playbook, a product that is exclusively booklets, I never pull a booklet card. So that is exciting. Hopefully it's not just all single colors. Hopefully it uh, lives up to the, the hype that I'm building up for it in my brain. Ben Roethlisberger, ooh, that's an EJ Manuel canvas card. Ronnie Lott in the back and uh, Robert Woods. I don't want to see what the auto is yet, so that's an EJ Manuel. I'm not going to look, I'm not going to look. I'm going to flip over the EJ to see if it's, uh, nope, it's not numbered. Received a canvas collection reproduction. Uh, card was inspired by the professional. It's very cool, though. Not sure how rare those are. But still, and here we go. Andre Ellington, you have received a museum rookie quad relic. Quad relic, let's hope for a multicolored patch. Ooh, wow. So three single color red and one nice white with stitching on black. Andre Ellington, I seem to pull a lot of him. And uh, obviously he's a Clemson running back. A lot of guys have high hopes for him, especially Phil B. Hughes. Clemson guy over there. So, let's see what we got in this pack. Denard Robinson rookie card. Tony Romo. Ray Rice. Terrell Davis. And let's see who this is. Browns and Buccaneers. So, two of the worst teams in the league. I'm thinking, I would love to see Mike Glennon. And who would we have from the Cleveland Browns? Doug Martin, Trent Richardson and Doug Martin. How about that? Two 2012 rookies. Oh, shoot. That's numbered one out of five. Those booklets are rare. Holy crap. Let me try to focus in on that. Numbered one out of five. Doug Martin, Trent Richardson. Pretty sweet. Not multicolored patches, but that just goes to show you a lot of the veteran type stuff you could find in this so that's pretty cool and of course they're touting their uh, tops fb twitter account really cool really pretty exciting i didn't even know they've got booklets i've, I've been scouring ebay for museum cards and i did not even know these existed but uh, when they're that short printed uh, that's probably why they'll probably start appearing soon so that's it that's my box of tops museum a good mix of uh Autographs, memorabilia, multicolored patches. Got that canvas collection. Oh, I love that John Elway. Every time I see Jonathan Franklin, I'm a little bit disappointed because everybody wants Eddie Lacy. I hope uh, Jonathan Franklin ends up doing something. But uh, right now it seems like Eddie Lacy, the Eddie Lacy show. So there's the booklet. Sydney Rice out of 50, beautiful patch autograph. John Elway, parallel out of 99, Jonathan Franklin. There's my EJ Manuel canvas. Andre Ellington, 
And that's it, guys. So that's it for uh, 2013 Tops Museum Football. Uh, subscribe on YouTube, like it, and uh, uh, we're going to be giving these cards away through Busting Packs or Sports Card Albums. So uh, go to BustingPacks.com, check out the review, uh, read the description in YouTube. I'll probably update it with contest information, how we're going to give these cards away. And uh, definitely start using Sports Card Album for your photo management needs, getting that image code to trade cards on the forums and whatnot. Uh, thanks a lot.